According to universal laws and the science of quantum physics, everything in the universe is fundamentally made of pure energy. This energy is constantly moving, oscillating, and vibrating at different speeds. The universe speaks to you through a vibrational frequency. This energy vibrates and creates all things we are aware of and unaware of. All things in our environment vibrate, including solid objects, electricity, sound, radio waves, etc. The law of vibration states that the vibrational frequency in which you vibrate will attract the same vibration back to you. What are you attracting with your thought and feeling vibrations? Vibration refers to the general energy or presence of something in a spiritual sense. It can be the energy or presence of a person or a place or other things. Higher vibration is more spiritual, more advanced, more godlike than lower. Your vibration is a fancy way of describing your overall state of being. Everything in the universe is made up of energy vibrating at different frequencies. Even things that look solid are made up of vibrational energy fields at the quantum level. This includes you. From a scientific and metaphysical perspective, we are a being that is made up of different energy levels, physical, mental, emotional, and spiritual. Each of these levels has a vibrational frequency which combine to create your overall vibration of being. When you operate from a high vibration, you deepen your connection with source energy. You begin to make a quantum leap of sorts into the very best version of yourself. Your mind, body, and spirit will begin to balance out in perfect harmony, and as a result, you will naturally feel amazing. Basically, your overall well-being will be enhanced. It's important to remember that the law of attraction is based on the concept that like attracts like. You don't manifest what you want, you manifest what you are. Like energy attracts like energy. That's physics. Struggling for abundance does not work. Recognize the energetic power of you and what it offers the world. It's all about vibrational alignment, frequency, and harmony. Low density and vibration energies can be negative emotions and thoughts, attachments, imprints, entities, and even spells and curses. This is probably one of the most significant advantages of raising your vibration, as low vibration energies are no longer part of your reality. The energy of your thoughts creates your reality. So become conscious of your thoughts. Everything you say, think, or feel becomes your reality. So if you have a negative thought, just tell it to go away. The lower your vibration, the more likely you are to attract circumstances to you that mirror this. And the higher your vibration, the more good you attract and doors just open to all the positive stuff. If you are interested in raising your vibration, this is done through intention and focus. The energy that you hold in your vibrational field resonates out, not only to the others around you, but the plants and animals and all the other dimensions and planes of existence. When your frequency is clear and bright, higher frequency beings will connect with you more often and the connection will be much clearer. The higher the frequency in which you vibrate, the higher consciousness you will have. Raising your consciousness and vibration, your perceptions of the world, will change your experiences. Raising your consciousness and vibration, your perceptions of the world will change. Your experiences change. You'll see yourself attracting more abundance, experiencing deeper relationships, and connections with others. If you send out conflicting vibrations, you will feel stuck. There will be a sense of non-movement and confusion over your next step in life, and you will feel like you are struggling and not in the flow. Your vibrational frequency depends directly on the degree that this fragmentation into the lower densities happens. The more attached you've become in the physical, for example, lowers your frequency into that density of being. Some people radiate more light than others. 
We all have known these light-filled individuals at one time or another. They are more positive and tend to try to do all or some of the things described above. Simply being in their presence can elevate us. Seek to be around uplifting friends and people. Raising of your vibrational frequency begins to happen as you start to realize your interconnection with the universe and the deeper meaning of life. Or else there's a powerful surrendering moment as you realize the fruitlessness of struggle in life. This surrender begins to free up the soul, which comes active in your life, reminding you of the universal connection. The higher your vibration, the more expansive your aura and energies become. You take up more space and feel the underlying energetic connections with all of existence more deeply and profoundly. You tend to feel a more palpable connection and knowing of the universe around you. Everyone has a potential within themselves to rise to a higher vibration than what they are currently resonating at. That potential can be realized or ignored depending on how much fear or self-sabotage one experiences on a regular basis. If you are triggered by an issue or you have the same issue or pattern, it is best to work on it. It'll open up your consciousness so that your higher self is more available to you. In order to experience joy and inner happiness and live in the high vibrational emotions, we have to learn how to raise our vibration on a regular basis. And here are the most important ways to raise your vibration. Watch your thoughts and what you say, as well as being aware of how you behave. All of these things will either raise or lower your vibration. Your words have a direct correlation to your vibrational frequency and the experiences that you have. Other ways of raising your vibration would be meditation. If you meditate for three minutes, your vibration will move up a little bit, but you will be unable to retain the frequency. Surrounding yourself with people in high spirits will help to motivate and inspire you while keeping your spiritual energies charged. Surrounding yourself with people who motivate, inspire, and support your aspirations is really important for maintaining a high vibration. Listening to Solfeggio Frequencies The Solfeggio Frequencies are a series of six electromagnetic musical tones that the Gregorian monks were said to use when they chanted in meditation. Physicist, inventor, and electrical engineer Nikola Tesla once said, If you only knew the magnificence of the three, six, and nine, then you would hold a key to the universe. These three numbers form the root vibration of the six solfeggio frequencies. The 396 hertz solfeggio frequency helps those who struggle with feelings such as guilt, fear, and grief. 417 hertz. This sound frequency helps you to clear negativity and remove subconscious blockages in the form of limiting core beliefs, toxic thinking patterns, and harmful habits. 528 hertz is often thought of as the love frequency. This sound vibration is also said to be central to creation and is thought to restore inner equilibrium, increase awareness, repair DNA, and stimulate transformation. 639 hertz increases understanding, tolerance, interpersonal harmony, and empathy. As such, the FA tone is said to strengthen relationships, family connection, and unity with others. 741 hertz helps to detox the body from all types of pollutants, viral, fungal, bacterial, electromagnetic, this sound vibration is also said to be useful when trying to solve problems as it will increase mental clarity. 852 hertz awakens your intuition and helps you return to spiritual balance. This tone also helps you to see through illusions and discover the highest truth, aiding you in communicating more openly with spirit. Meditate every day and you will notice the energy frequency around you shifting and changing. Eating higher frequency foods will definitely have an impact on the energy around you. Pranic breath work is another technique that will help raise our vibration. Cleaning your chakras and auric field at least once a day 
will positively help your energy field and raise your frequency. Focus on feeling good and being aware of your thoughts and keeping your focus on how you feel is key in keeping your vibration high. When you are aware of what you think about, you can start to consciously shift your thoughts to a more positive place. Reduce consumption of low vibrational food, water, and products. If you are consuming medications, drugs, alcohol, meat, sugar, etc., you are filling your mind, body, and energy field with low vibrational energy. Intermittent Fasting Fasting is a powerful method to still the internal physical and emotional metabolism. As these processes quiet, the consciousness of the soul can more easily permeate through. Drink water. Always ensure you drink plenty of water, filtered as best, to assist your body to flush out toxicity day to day. Toxicity has a marked impact on our vibration, so we must do what we can to reduce its impact within us and around us. Be grateful. Making a gratitude list shifts your vibrations from focusing on what you don't have to what is already abundant in your life. There is more to be grateful for than you could possibly imagine. Practice acts of kindness. Giving to someone else without expecting anything in return shifts your thinking from I don't have enough to I have more than enough to give to others. Abundance is a high vibration. In the same vein, being kind puts you at a high vibration. Science tells us that human beings and all creatures radiate an electromagnetic field produced by the heartbeat. Our feelings broadcast like radio waves through this field. When you are in the presence of a group of friends, family, or others, everyone's thoughts, feelings, and attitudes are intermingling in your immediate area. An easy way to maintain a higher vibration is to interweave the qualities of our heart in our connections and interactions. These heart qualities include love, care, compassion, kindness, appreciation, forgiveness, and more. As light workers, it is easy for us to pick up on lower vibrational energies. It is also easy for us to use our tools to release that energy and keep our vibration at its highest potential. Show yourself how much you love yourself by focusing on higher vibrational thoughts and feelings today.